dear viewers subscribers and my dear parents and my dear students today we are going to see a wonderful song in the lesson of wheel optics by seeing the sum itself you are going to find the answer immediately you want to learn that yes let us join with me now we will have a, a great sum now to view for a, a shorter answer with just with not more than 3 seconds see the sum here in the board you can have to see the sum here coming like a rocket yes see the sum what is the sum it is given in the board in the screen the sum has been given as two light wave having an intensity of 64 is to 1 remember the point only that important point you have to remember the one is intensity which has been encircled there see there encircled and the second one is the ratio that is 64 is to 1 and what is the answer they ask? They ask I max by I minimum. That is ratio of I max by I minimum. The options are it is A, it is 100 is to 49, B, it is 64 is to 1, and C, it is 81 is to 49. And finally, B, it is given as none. So you are going to find the answer without using any concept and without using any formula. If you go with the concept and with the formula, what will happen? Exactly you are right, it will take at least a minimum more than 5 minutes to solve the answer. Now we are going to solve without using any formula and without any concept. Yes, let us find the answer now immediately by seeing the sum. Now let us go for the hint. And what is the hint? Without using any formula and without using any concept, we are going to find the answer with a small trick and with a small hint. You want to see the hint? To go with the answer immediately, you have to learn the square of the numbers. You know what is square of, square of the numbers? It has been given in the screen. Just see the screen. It has been given as 1, 4, 9, 16, 25, that is 36, 64, 81, and with 100, and it goes on. Now, what is the ratio we are having? We are having 64 is to 1. Again, I will circle it. 64 is to 1 is the given question. And now what you are going to do is, you are going to see the square root where that 64 comes. If you see the square root number, there is a 64 in which I have inserted. You will tell me what is the number after 64 and what is the number before 64. So after 64, the square root number is 81. Remember, it has been inserted day, 81. And what is the number? Before the 64, it is 49. Then our answer is, yes, you are right. We got the answer as 81 is to 49. Then what is the option? The option A, B, C, D has been given. Again, I am just plotting in the screen. Then where is the option is there? Yes, it is right. The option is C. It is 81 is to 49. Now you tell me how many seconds you have taken. You have taken not even more than 3 seconds. If you are well thorough with the square root numbers, then it is very easy for us to find what is the given question and what is the square root number after the given and before the given. So this is the trick to learn. Let us move on to the one more sum in the same method. Again, we are going for the practice sum, the second sum now. You can able to see the same type of question in the screen now. It is coming like a rocket now. Yes, you view the question. What are the two important words you have to remember? The one is intensity, the other one is ratio. So, I have inserted again the second question in a similar fashion. It is the intensity has been encircled, and the second one is it has been encircled the ratio that is 25 is to 1. And there are four options given. What are they? A. Option 9 is to 4. B. The option is 3 is to 2. And C, the option is 3 is to 4. And finally, it is going with none of them. And what will be your answer? I know that you got the answer. So now let us go for the child and error with a small hint. What is the hint given? I have already given the hint. It is, we have to go with a square root. So now you tell me, what is the square root of the 25? Yes, it is 36. Then what is the square root before 25? It is 16. Then we get the answer as 36 by 16 with which we can divide by a common table by 9 and 4 and the answer is it is 9 is to 4.
So what is the option A? It is 9 is to 4, then your answer is 9 is to 4. I hope you learned the trick now. So don't forget to remember, you have to view the channel and all the videos completely and subscribe my channel and share to all of your friends. Thank you very much and bye.